available at the depot at 2nd and King Street and post game carriers will be departing soon. Chad Babcock will stand in. He, too, had three hits in the win last night. Here comes a 2-2. Breaking ball swung on and grounded to second. And that's through for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Number 25 will stand in to start things out with his guys pretty fortunate to get out of that last half inning with the game still scoreless. Yeah, they were able to dodge a bases loaded situation. That could have gotten out of hand quickly, so maybe they can calm their guy down a bit by getting a couple runs here. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Do you even bother with anything else here? No, I sure wouldn't. As a hitter, you're thinking, look for fastball, adjust for an off-speed pitch. And so far in this at-bat, he hasn't made any adjustments. Ball swung on and hit high down the line in left, but it'll get back in among the crowd, so the count holds it 0-2. Ready with another 0-2. Now a swing and another ball that I believe will find its way into the seats. Still 0-2. Another 0-2 coming. This is offered at in the dirt for strike three. Just needs to make that easy throw to first. Throw on to first is in time to get him. So that'll go down as a strikeout and a 2-3 to three put out for route number one. Rafael Diaz will start things out. Bottom third of the order, 7, 8, and 9 to start out the home half of the second. And they probably still can't believe they didn't get anything out of that first game. They got the bases loaded, but just couldn't cash in. And he's retired one away. Jason Wilson will stand in here. He was set down on strikes to start the home first. The one-two. Swing and a ball hit hard on the ground towards second. On to second for the force out, and the side is retired. So no runs on a hit here, no errors. One man left on. We've played two full. 
And we are tied, nothing, nothing. Number 25 will stand in with two on and two out here in the third. Now the first pitch. And this is going to be fouled into the diamond level seats. Runners lead from first and third. Here's the pitch. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Well, this is the kind of situation where they came up short last night. They had opportunities, but they could never really cash them in. So you can bet they'd love to get something going on the board early here. Oh, they have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. Here comes a one, two. In the dirt and block behind the plate. And he'll be tagged out heading toward the plate. And with that, the inning is over. Chad Babcock will stand in. A base hit his first time around. Comes set. Now the pitch. Ground ball to second. This could be two. Throw over to third here. Oh, the throw will be too late at third. And that's going to load the bases here. Bruce Cisneros will dig in here with a chance early on to give his pitcher a little cushion to work with. Needs a punch out here. Can he get it? A swing, and he pops him up on the infield. And the infield fly rule will be in effect here. Number 25 will step forward now to lead things off. And after that last half inning, his guys are going to have some work to do. Yeah, those five run innings are tough to bounce back from, but there's still time. They don't need to panic. They just need to focus on getting a few guys on base. Here. Now here it comes. Oh, and he can't hold on there as he swings and misses on a pitch in the dirt, and he's down 0-2 now. Well, you don't expect a guy who's having a year like this guy is having to take an ugly hack like that. Lays off that time, and it's 1-2. and two. A classic strikeout pitch there on 0-2. It's one he loves going to, but great recognition there at the plate to lay off. Taken the other way, but this should be routine out there in right field. He'll put it away without much trouble, and the leadoff man is retired here in the fourth. Rod Siffel will dig in. He walked and later scored last time. He's set. Now the pitch. Swing. Hard hit ball to second. The second for one. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. Rick Green will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 25 will dig in. 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. First offering on the way. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0 and 1. Yeah, and it seems like he kind of got away from that pitch here in the last few innings. You got to think about bringing that one right back. Out of play. The pitch. And a breaking ball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. So two runs on one hit, and the one hit was a big one, the home run. Mike Pelfrey is going to take over here in inning number five as it's going to be up to their bullpen to try and keep them in the game here. Number 25 will step in now in a big spot here in a game as close as this one. And a chance at redemption, too, because he hasn't done much through his first three plate appearances. Meanwhile, this ball gets down. It's a base hit. Around third and being waved on home. And that's going to plate the tying run from second, and we are all even at five aside. Pedro Chang will come on now as he inherits a runner at first with already one out in the inning. Reggie Rhodes will be the first to greet him here as he'll stand in with a runner at first and one away. Action in the bullpen now as the right-hander begins to throw out there. Pitch outside the throw, and he got him at second on a perfect throw. Number 25 will step in, one for four in the ball game. First pitch coming. 
swing and a shot toward right center. Babcock is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Salvador Perez is on now to try to close things down here in the ninth. An entertaining game all in all, so if we have to choose one who stood out among all others, why not go with this man right here? He's our top player of the game. Yeah, he was definitely a big part of this victory. You see there, four RBIs for him in the ball game. He came through when they needed him to, and he was instrumental in the win. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening.